So in this video, I'm going to show you how to make this frosted glass effect in After Effects. So first of all, what we're going to do is we're going to make a new shape layer and create a random shape out of it. It doesn't need to be anything efficient, just make a random shape. Okay, when you have your shape layer, uh, we're going to go here and we're going to create it into an adjustment layer by click on, clicking on this icon. Okay, so now we're going to apply some effects to it. Go zoom there and just increase the amount to whatever you like. The second effect is transform effect. This is just to add like a magnifying effect. What we're going to do is we are going to increase the scale to about something like this. And we're going to change the position as well. So basically just to create like a distortion effect and just adjust the setting to whatever you like. Okay, now as you can see there is like a magnifying effect on it now. So in order to make it a lot better we're going to duplicate the shape layer and disable the adjustment layer on it. Okay now what we're going to do is we're going to delete all the effects and go to the fill option and just do copy my settings. You can change the color to whatever you like. Right now the theme is blue so I'm going to do it accordingly. I'll decrease the opacity to something like this we just want like a slight gradient on it just to add a bit of the texture on the glass so it's not completely transparent if that makes sense okay now we're just going to adjust the points something is good now just enable the stroke because you also want uh, want a small boundary on it as you can see there's like a small boundary on the glass so it is prominent it's not like just la just like a blurred layer now I'm going to add another effect to it, which is light sweep. Just copy my settings right here uh, if you want. We're going to increase the width a bit. So it looks really natural. Now this looks good. Now we have uh, our glass fully completed. Ja now just duplicate the layer and repeat the process for the other glass as well. Make sure you adjust the direction of the light sweep because uh, the effect doesn't follow with the position of the of the shape layer. All right, so this looks good. We're just gonna repeat the process. Okay, now as you can see, uh, we have cool reflection and we also have like a magnifying effect on it. It looks really good now what we're gonna do is we're going to duplicate the ball and place it on top okay now as you can see we have a cool parallax effect so the ball is in front of the glass now just adjust the setting and the position of the layers so you can see every ball Oops. now we're gonna keep make an adjustment layer and put deep glow on it just copy my settings right here and make sure to decrease the exposure and change the threshold also because a lot of editors don't do that and it does not look good Alright, you can even play with the threshold smoothness if you want and make sure to change the expect ratio a little as well. Alright, so now this is how it looks like. And yeah, this is my first tutorial. So if you find anything helpful or if you think some things could be better, just let me know in the comments. And I'm also building a Discord community where you can join and chat with other editors. So yeah, see you later.